what kind people i want to show you my room i'm staying at actually i'm leaving this place now because i was staying here for two days i was very tired i was doing some work but i want to show you the room so before i go let me show you so first of all when you enter the door over here you got some switches here low rider switches you can put the lights off put the lights on whatever switch up and down the tv don't work nothing ever works over here as soon as you see brown cupboards like this anywhere color doors you must know that this place is very very old that's basically how what i'm learning here so far the fridge don't work it's not even connected but anyway i did not dare to even open this cupboard up here because last time i learned my lesson so i only here for two days i'm not going to put anything in the cupboard i never open it and i'm very happy i didn't this side they got a chair and a section where you can sit there there's always a ash tray everything is like a smoking section and there is the bed now <sighs> the bedding was filthy can you see it? The pillows were filthy. And to tell you the honest truth, when I came here to this hotel, I was in a room one floor down and there were stains on the bed and it was stinking like, like shit. Honestly, it looked, I smelled, the whole room was stinking. And I only tell you, because when you walk in, they put the aircon on, they put the fan on, so you can't really smell anything, you know what I mean? Then when I put it off, and after about an hour, I see the stains there because once I was feeling sleepy, I see the pillowcase is dirty. I went to smell the thing, it smelled like someone was sleeping there and drooling there for like 10 hours. And like, you know, like breath smell, you know what I mean? Like, oh, it was bad. Anyway, here's my bags here, packed. I still need to push this thing down here. And you got a telephone to call. There's a food things over here. The aircon works. The aircon works very low, which I like because in like a small room, you don't really want to put the aircon on and blasting and then five minutes later, you're suffering because it's cold. Don't smack that. The mirror here. This place is not very neat, not very clean that well, you know. And then there's a window here where you open up here and you can see outside the main road. But there's a hot breeze coming in, so... But, like, this is the only ventilation you get. So what I was doing was opening the window, opening the door, getting a draft in, blowing all the smells and everything out there. You know, you're sitting here in one small room, breathing, farting, whatever it smells. Anyway, I don't know why they got a lock here to lock the door from the outside. Anyway, this is the bathroom. I had a bath there. So it's kind of wet, so I'm not going to go inside. And uh, the shower doesn't work. So I've been having bucket bath. I've been having bucket bath for a long time now, eh? Whew. The window don't close. And I think maybe that's why they have a lock here, because maybe there's like squirrels, squirrel, maybe there's squirrels or something coming inside. I don't know. But there's lots of squirrels over here. So yeah, the toilet is fine. The tickler works fine. The geezer actually works. And uh, yeah, I've been having bucket bath. For a very long time so that's that now let's get to this part let me show you you have to see it i don't I have to show you i'm sorry about this that is a cockroach stuck there that's a money one there and a money one there now this is part of a family the first night that i was here i don't know why i didn't record this i was i was such in a bad mood <sighs> i killed probably about 30 to 40 cockroaches they're about so big so all the parents everything gone yeah, right so that's what i spent i spent till three in the morning i was so paranoid because i kept feeling like they're gonna crawl up in the bed and stuff so <sighs> this place is infested with cockroaches infested i can't even tell you last night i only killed one so basically the first night i mapped all of them out except for the bathroom every time you open the bathroom in the evening Whew, it's full cockroaches. So yeah, I'm going to another place now, which I'll show you guys. I'm hoping it'll be much better than this day. I'm actually, I phoned them and I told them I'm coming there. I want to look at the room first. I'm going to go and inspect. I don't know how I'm going to find cockroaches, but I'm going to try. Yeah, anyway, my name is Oji Two Scoops. I spent 240 Rand for this place a night, which was a waste of money, to be honest with you. Even the Wi-Fi, they switched it off. They switched it off in the day and stuff. So yeah. My name is Oji Two Scoops. Check you out next time.